Hey, what's going on everybody? I know times are pretty crazy right now with this whole COVID-19 stuff and staying at home mandates and all that. But uh, during this time, I just want to give you maybe three things or three activities that you could do while you're staying at home during this whole quarantine process. Uh, so here they are. Hey, how did you get here? <laughs> All right, well, this is my little helper for this first activity. Hey, Jonah, you wanna help me? We're gonna do an unboxing. You wanna help me open it? <laughs> All right, so I received this box. Um, it was probably back last October in 2019, and I was gonna do an unboxing back then, but we had some family medical issues. Uh, my wife had a miscarriage in October, and then I went to Africa in November, when I got back from Africa, um, my wife, Caitlin, had a brain tumor surgery. So things have been very crazy for us lately. Uh, she is recovering. She's helping me with this video right now. Thank you, sir. <laughs> um, but yeah, so Jonah, our boy, is gonna help me open this. You wanna help? Here you go, buddy, it's ready for ya. You want me to come over to you? Yeah? Where do you want to come over here? Huh? You want to sit right here and do it? Uh, uh, uh. What is it? Oh my word. I got some pretty cool stuff here. Huh? What is it? called a Rubik's Cage. That's really neat. You wanna play with it? Yeah? Should we see what else is in here first? Here, wanna pull that out? Pull it out like this. There you go, pull it. Whoa! What is it? What is this, Jonah? Color blocks. Huh? I haven't seen this one before. It looks a lot like the mirror cube. Wow, looks very similar to the mirror cube. Look at this. Oh wow. Um, give Rubik's color blocks a twist and you'll have a whole new puzzle experience in your hand. I'll have to do research on this. Even the pieces look the exact same. That's really neat. So yeah, we have color blocks right here. And what do we have here? The Rubik's cage. open up this lid and then you know all these pieces <laughs> it's kind of like uh, what like tic not that tic-tac-toe game but um it's like where you do that three in a row i forgot what that name is called uh, but you put these in and you want to try and get three of the same color so if you have two people playing since there's six colors you would do three colors for him, three colors for me. Is that fun, Jonah? <laughs> oh. Oh, that's what they did. You get to put this back on and then you flip it over mm -hmm. so then it's not three in a row. Or, you know, two in a row so they don't get three. Oh, then we'll take this back off. Oh, you're smart. Yeah. You wanna put that back in? Good job. High five. High five. Thank you. Oh, as I put this knife away now, we can talk to you about activity number two. Well, I guess not really an activity, just something to do. Um, so, Caitlin, like I said, she had a um, brain tumor surgery in December, and throughout the whole time we were at the hospital, I uh, recorded and documented pretty much everything that we did, and um, except for the surgery. But uh, just her recovery process, rehab, and all that stuff. Uh, at the hospital, I created a music video, which I Hi. uploaded it to um, this channel just maybe like a week ago or so, and I'm going to have that um, right up, up here, so you can click that um, that link, and also I'll have it in the, the video description below, but please check out that video and to see um, just how great of recovery Caitlin had uh, during the whole process and just uh, the awesome work that God did for her. So. That is number two. 
All right, number three. What you can do is head to your office or your toy box, go through all the toys that you have, and I'm sure you'll come across one of these. A Rubik's Cube that is not solved. And I'm sure you've got it maybe as a gift, maybe five, 10, 15, even 20 years ago, and just haven't solved it yet. So I recommend just click on this link above or in the description below, because right now during this quarantine process, it's the perfect time to learn how to solve this. There's, there's no excuses why you can't. Just take a little bit of time and just solve this cube. It's that easy. All right guys, well thank you so much for watching this video on the three things that you could do while being quarantined in your house during this whole COVID-19 ordeal. I hope you guys stay healthy um, as much as possible. And um, again, just thank you so much for watching. You can watch my wife's video and also the three x three on how to solve the Rubik's Cube. All right, I hope you guys have a good day. Bye.